when you look around, there is all this doom and gloom everywhere, except in, in India. And so, you know, in a sense, there is such a positive feeling, uh, spirit, uh, and, and incredible work that is happening from across the board in all sectors. This, the sort of the spirit of entrepreneurship and uh, a can-do attitude, it is incredibly uh, impressive and infectious, uh, you know. So I think in a, in a way, when I look at the, the future, um, I see that, you know, um, in a world that is going to be transformed by AI, by these technologies, uh, India can play such a fundamental role, not only for India itself, but for the entire world. And I think we need to unleash our, our innovative spirit and uh, uh, solve the big problems that are out there. It is right now our canvas, ours to build on. Right. Very quickly, Vishal, uh, last question to you. Uh, like Rajan also mentioned, you know, uh, we need to eventually get to growth rate of maybe 8 to 10%, uh, looking at the kind of population and looking at the kind of working population that we have. Now, how we can effectively leverage, uh, let's say, technologies like AI, generate enough jobs, educate people about it, and again, sort of emerge as a leader the way we did back in the day uh, in software industry. The, um, by, by training, by education, having a tremendous focus on, on that, you know, we have to always look at the, um, the number of people who can use the technology, the number of people who can uh, build with this technology, the number of people who can actually build the next generations of chat GPT and GPT-4 and what have you. Um, the more that we can enable these uh, th these numbers, and we have massive numbers, you know, we have a, we are a young country. Uh, so I see that the enablement of the skills and the training as one of the fundamental needs and uh, and opportunities, and and then the the creation of the jobs and all of this will will follow from there. The world is looking for um, for you know for technology like this. One thing that I feel particularly good about is that a number of the, the number of global products that are coming out of India has increased significantly in the last few years. It used to be that we, you know, we were more, we provided services to others and so forth. But now we are building innovative products which are global in nature. And I think this needs to be really multiplied and, and, uh, and encouraged uh, even, even more. Um, and so the, the way it works is, you know, Steve Jobs always said, you connect the dots looking backwards. Uh, the, uh, the, the employment, the prosperity are all consequences of the fact that you have such, such a workforce that is able to innovate like that. And then, you know, the growth rates and, and all of these things follow from there. But you have to um, put the, the horse in front of the cart and uh, that is the skilled um, people who are skilled in next generations of capabilities. Mm -hmm.